his doctor, who is, is not a medical doctor, but a DO, a doctor of osteopathic medicine, there is a difference between the two, uh, said that he is in great shape, is uh, Dr. <laughs> Bruce Aronwald, okay. DO. My name is Dr. Jen Cottle. I'm a board-certified osteopathic family physician, and I wanted to tell you exactly who DOs are so there is no confusion. There are two degrees that lead to the practice of medicine in the United States, DOs and MDs. Also, I need to say up front that DOs, osteopathic physicians, we are not inferior to MDs. We work side by side. We work together. We train together. We are colleagues. Also, number three, both DOs and MDs are licensed to practice all specialties of medicine in every state. And the application requirements for MD DO schools are virtually the same, as well as the curriculum. The curriculum of both med school programs is largely the same as well. 25% of U.S. medical students train at osteopathic medical schools, and there are 41 U.S. colleges of osteopathic medicine. In addition, DOs go to medical school, we go to residency, we take board exams. Again, I'm an osteopathic, a board certified osteopathic family physician. We do this just like MDs do. And if you're wondering what makes us different, uh, well, uh, DOs learn an additional skill of osteopathic manipulative treatment. I've got videos on that and so much more. It's important to know that there are two types of physicians licensed to practice medicine and surgery in this country. It is DOs and MDs, and we practice side by side. For more information, go to the American Osteopathic Association the American Association of Colleges of Osteopathic Medicine, or the American Medical Association, or DM me for more videos.